Hello everyone, this is Justin with Green Residential. So today I'm looking at a toilet tank. Now this is a Kohler toilet and this type of flap system is different from your normal one. This is your kind of standard type of toilet flap, flapper. This one is, is different. That yellow uh, seal down there looks like this. And what's happening with this uh, toilet tank, what the issue is, is that seal is failing and so what happens is the water level slowly drops in the tank to a point where it's up, um, this thing will drop far enough and you'll hear that. It'll kick on so you'll hear that toilet tank filling randomly. Now this can waste water so it should be replaced. Okay so the shutoff valve on this toilet is not really fully shutting the water off. When you turn it all the way off water still uh, flows into the toilet tank so that needs to be replaced but that's a, another video for another time. Um, what I've done is I just simply take, took some blue tape and put it around this, to this arm right here on the fill valve and taped it to the side so hopefully that should work. Now what we're doing is we're changing out this flapper um, that, or the seal, sorry, that's down there for a new one, and it's it's pretty straightforward. I'm gonna try to show you with one hand. That's easier said than done sometimes. So basically, this thing needs to turn. So there's this pipe here, and inside there's this shaft, and inside uh, around that shaft is this other little kind of pipe, or I don't know what the right word is, but basically this moves up and down, and it can go up to here, but this will stop it from uh, fully going all the way off, which we need to do. So to remove it, you're gonna have to remove this shaft and you just turn it, you gotta be careful. You wanna basically unclick un it kind of, and I'll show you. So that little part right there clips into that. And you wanna be careful when uh, uh, putting it, take, taking it in and out because you don't want to break that. So the way this comes off is this simply just peels right off. And if you look here, there's a groove that the new one will slide into. So let's get the new one. All right. And you just kind of make sure that it's being put in that groove. It's actually a simple procedure just the problem is doing it with one hand isn't so easy <laughs> but anyways you just make sure it's in the groove all the way around so there we go so that's the new flapper and now we need to align this with that part down there so whenever you're working with this part you want to kind of be as careful as possible so you don't break anything. So I'm going to align it. Okay, it's not so obvious, but I did align it. I believe I did. And then you just tighten it, you turn it to the left or to the right. It's in there, you don't need to over tighten it. Um, it just needs to be tight enough to hold hold things in place. So now this can move up and down without any problem. So let's remove the blue tape. Water is now filling the tank. And that new seal should solve the problem with the water level slowly falling in this toilet tank. Well, I hope this video was uh, helpful. If you found it helpful, it would be much appreciated if you hit that thumbs up button. You know, we put out videos like this on a regular basis, and they include simple repairs that many homeowners can do, and they also include a lot of house knowledge and information. So if you feel so inclined, um, if you want to hit that subscribe button, it'd be much appreciated. Well, have a great day, and bye for now.